being preoccupied. With life? Yeah. I got like, I got a huge test and then I'm just tired. We're about tired. I wish something would, one of the stuff would be done with, but it doesn't look like anything's happen. This look pretty good. Mm-hmm. There's a lot, but maybe you, she do you want bone in or do you want no bone? Well, bones mean flavor, but no bones means it cooks faster. Are you sure? Uh, yes. It's a lot of meat. Hmm? We'll get one of these. Yeah, it is. We used to get them all the time. We haven't had pork chops in forever. Yeah, I just wanted to buy some meat. I plan to make them seriously unhealthy. I cover them in breadcrumbs and cheese. What? Oh. So you want to make them unhealthy? Mm-hmm. That sounds like something you would do. Alright, we'll grab some cut. Okay. Oh, I realize you were baking. The bakery section was so large. Yeah, it's pretty big. Don't trip. I want. You can cut her own. That is way too much meat. Oh, really? Don't feed her. It's too late. I know. Fruit. Is there like a mixed fruit do you see or is it all individual bags? Uh, well there's blueberry and strawberry, that's what it is. Ah. It's not dole. Dole, it says mixed fruit. Uh, I see a pineapple, some peaches. Oh. Pineapple, mango, peaches, and strawberries. Perfect. Throw it in. And now we should get the cheesecake. <laughs> Your cheesecake should be good too. Oh, don't tell me that. Especially get like, like cheesecake, but I think you get like a trio. No. Oh, that looks delicious. That does look delicious. You should take me to the cheesecake factory. Isn't the cheesecake factory like really expensive? Yes. Chibane. Like unnecessarily expensive? Uh. So are a lot of places. Glad to get some healthy snacks back in our life. Do you want to get some plain Greek yogurt too? Yeah. Protein get out of here. Yes, so that's already like a hundred dollars in a cart. One thing I can't stand about Sam's Club. Yeah. Yeah. Five. Yeah, so five things and it costs like a hundred dollars. Yay. Go on. Alright, so we start out. Yeah. 
gotta find some kind of fat to incorporate. So Yeah, I know for me I'm gonna want like a quick energy snack. Like I know that for me sometimes I get too hungry to do anything smart. So if we could just get like one kind of prepackaged snack and since we're gonna be getting it from here we can probably find like a one that doesn't have, you know, any high fructose corn syrup or anything like that. But oh, I'm gonna need like something that I can just grab when I'm just about to faint. Not <laughs> truth, you probably just, you probably just get like some um, like a bag of little trial uh, candy bars and shit. Well, that is not healthy. <laughs> it's, it's not about being healthy. It's about, it's about increasing your, uh, about giving your bloody uh, our blood sugar blood up. Sugar. Yeah. It's not so much about trying to eat healthy at that point, it's just don't go into like a diabetic, diabetic shock. Yeah. Um, like hard candies are really good, like some you can suck on. Um, something that increases sugar. It's really a shame, I mean, if you can get like some weekly like more juice and stuff for you, it's really good, but. Too bad, I'm allergic to all that. Yeah. So that kind of hurts. Right. We're going to Central Market. It's just like Whole Foods except for here. It's the same thing, yeah. It's probably the same store. They're all the same. It just depends what they have. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna go in. Point of view, uh, it's your hands. I do have an avocado chair, which is exciting. Do you want to squash your zucchini or eggplant? No. Do you like any of that? I do, I just don't feel like them. You know, I might want some squash. I haven't had squash in a while. Kind of squash. Yellow. All right. How are you going to cook it? Normally. Well, My parents normal, so, you know, butter and sugar. Like, and... they literally took that sweet potato and killed it. They put, like, they put, like, three sticks of butter on it and then, like, two two cups of sugar. Candied yams. It's not yams. It's yams. They're the same thing. No, they're not. What is the difference between a yam and a sweet potato? Most of the location. Location? Yeah. So it's the same plant, but in a different area? It's a different plant. No. It's like you're saying cauliflower and broccoli. No. They're obviously different. Was I... Re okay. There probably is some sort of uh, minute botanical difference. Okay. You gotta look it up. Yeah. They had the new workout that came out. It looks horrible. As usual. Yeah. It's, it looks really bad. That's there. Sweet potatoes are dicot. The yams are monocot. Having, so they're different, um, genetically different. Well, whatever. The yams are closely related to lilies and grass. Grow mostly in, in Africa and Asia. Uh huh. And then sweet potatoes are a member of the Morning Glory family. Yeah. Why the confusion? Firm varieties of sweet potato are produced before soft varieties. Well, so it resembled the it resembled the yams of Africa, so they called them yams. Okay. So. Okay, so they're different. This is cool looking, isn't it? Look at how pretty that is. I bet it's delicious. <laughs> that looks that actually looks really good. It looks tasty for sure. 
do like an eggplant medley. I was thinking about doing like an avocado puree or like a dressing. That sounds really Avocados, interesting. Lime, garlic, and the garlic. Maybe some jalapenos, some spices. It sounds really good. It sounds like all the It's Yeah, it's pretty simple. Except similar. for you're going to puree it. So that way you can use it over anything pretty much. I forgot how you can tell these are right. This is a little... This part, right? Yeah. If it's yellow? Yeah, there's no black spots. <laughs> how many do you want? Two? Just two. It's two for three dollars. What a coincidence. Usually over there. I are over there. Oh, look at how nice these look. These are local, too. Because the top is touching that, and I don't want to. You realize they're buried in the ground and all that good stuff, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. We should buy a whole bunch of freezer. A bunch of what? We should buy some more and freeze. It looks like a little monster. It does look like a little monster. Corn. Those are huge and these are like super skinny, so I'll go for big care. It's like, oh, organic or good. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta make that choice. Okay, so here are all the groceries we got. Um, had to turn it off because we had to get our grocery shopping done and me holding the camera was not helpful. But we got everything we needed and everything on our list and we did not get anything extra. Which is, of course, the benefits of a list. The only thing that could be considered extra would be this. We got this. It was just one of those things that was right at the door. They had a sample, and we tried it, and it was really good. But I did need um, a snack, and I hadn't decided what my snack would be yet, and I needed something that was sweet, and or I needed something that was healthy, and Nick wanted something that was sweet for me because I get low blood sugar, and, and I just need to have something really quick. So this is like a pretty good compromise. It's, you know, kettle, kettle cooked popcorn, but it has peanut butter and chocolate on it. So it's healthy snack mixed with an unhealthy snack. So it's not really extra because it was a snack that I needed. So essentially, you know, we've got, we needed stuff because we hadn't gone grocery shopping in a few weeks. So we've got, you know, your basics or milk, eggs, um, and all of our fruits and vegetables. Usually we get it in paper, but the, today we got plastic because we're out of plastic bags and we need plastic bags to, for Charlie's litter box. Uh, so, yeah, we got everything we needed. First we went to Sam's Club and got all of the bulk items first. And we needed more trash bags. And Nick wanted some kind of protein snacks, so he got that. And um, we got a big thing of almonds and a big thing of bananas. And then we also got some Chobani, like a big thing of uh, Greek yogurt, and a big thing of uh, pork chops, and a large bag of fruit, and a large bag of fish, and then we went to Central Market and just got the rest of our fruits and vegetables and the rest of our groceries. So that's essentially how you grocery shop following your list and uh, we ended up spending, between both of them, it was around $260. We spent $163 uh, or $165.30 at Central Market, and that's where we got, you know, the bulk of our items, and plus an additional $102 at Sam's Club for our bulk items. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks, guys. Bye. Thank you.